This is something which affects an estimated 8 million women in the UK. It can be deeply traumatic, cause embarrassment and low self-esteem and lead to a sense of losing your femininity. I'm talking about female hair loss. Now, why is there still such a stigma attached to women losing their hair? And we want to break that taboo today and talk about how it affects you. And we've been running an exclusive Loose Women poll. And shockingly, 91% of you who took part said you were one worried about hair loss so is this something that we worry about and I think every woman were I think you're defined in a way by your hair and actually as Lord Litchfield the photographer said once more than clothes or makeup hair is the definitive thing in terms of the overall shape and for me like it or loathe it but I've always loved my hair and I've always sort of concentrated on my hair etc etc but last year I had a real blip because I had some, I'm allergic to some antibiotics and I was particularly allergic to this one and it upset my whole digestive system. And in order to settle that, I had to take um, a, a product, I'll not say the name, but it had cortisone in it. And I'm telling you, um, and it's a warning really to sort of check because many people are in drugs for different reasons, but this drug, my hair started to fall out. And, um, and I, I really couldn't understand it. And you've got to remember that I'm married to a man who once employed 29 hairdressers mm. in Bond Street. So, and he's got um, a thick head of hair himself. Mm. I've got a it? very <laughs> thick head of hair. So it was a real issue. My son was getting married last October. And I was heartbroken because I, I kept thinking, my son's getting married. And yet, look at it now. Sometimes I have so much hair now, I don't know what to do with it. Because <laughs> how having, did it make you feel then? I, I felt awful about it. And I was embarrassed that, it, you know, if I hadn't had a hat on the day of my son's wedding, I would have been really, really more upset than, than I was. And I think you mentioned losing your femininity. And if you worry about your hair or you've been interested in your hair, as, as I've been sort of because of television and stuff, I really felt a lesser person for a while. Yeah. And it just really yeah. bugged me. And, and I had somebody who was kind of looking after me as well. Um, but I discovered a product, and again, I'm not going to mention the name, but we can always put it online mm. or something. But it's, it, the, this is not the name of the product, but it has a fibrology. That is the key factor. And I discovered it quite by accident. You put on the shampoo as normal, then they have a little file of something or other, whatever it is, put that on for 10 or 20 minutes, add the conditioner, and honestly, within about... Now, admittedly, I'd stopped taking the tablets. Within about, I'd say, two to three weeks, the hair started and to And your hair improve. looks fantastic, mm. I have to well, say. I say, no, it's it looks... really... And that well, it was saying, you know, 